wanting to get some like ballet flats we have not quite like found the right pair. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I have a Target haul. I've been kind of accumulating pieces here and there for like probably the last month. And so now I can actually call it a haul <laughs> because before I would just get like one or two things. But on my latest run, I've just been finding so many cute things. And that'd be a great idea to share some fall going into winter inspired outfits as well as mom friendly outfits. I really like sharing like elevated casual and like dressier options. But most of the time I'm actually wearing like really comfortable like dress down outfits. So I kind of want to share some of my everyday outfits with you guys. As always, all the items will be linked down in the description description. I also have them pinned to the first comment down below. Make it a little bit easier for you to find the items. I also want to make sure that you guys are following along on Instagram and on my LTK. I have both of those links to like my LTK storefront as well as my Instagram down below. So if you're not already following me there, please do because I did have some items that are uh, did not arrive on time from Target. So I will be sharing them obviously on Instagram as well as my LTK. So you could definitely shop for them there. Also on my LTK, I have a ton of gift guides. I know we're going into the holiday season. So if you need some inspiration, I, I got you on my LTK. There's a ton of gift guides for you to check out. But uh, let's go ahead and get started with the first item, which is uh, what I'm wearing right now. So it's this cardigan. I'll stand up for you guys so you can see the color. I just kind of like styled it with just like buttoning the first two buttons and then just keeping this open. But really love this color. Obviously, it's, it's having a moment, burgundy, oxblood, whatever you want to call it. But I really loved this cardigan whenever um, I picked it up. Not only the color, but just like the fit, like it's a little bit oversized, but it just like, it still looks really streamlined. So it looks a lot more elevated than you would think. I know Target usually is elevated, but like I'm talking about like more expensive. Like you would probably find something like this at Madewell, probably at Nordstrom, just like a little bit more expensive, you know? I actually paired this cardigan with my Sofia Vergara jeans from Walmart. Those are the trouser jeans, which I absolutely love. I just feel like that color as well, that very dark denim looks so good with this uh, burgundy, but I really liked this sweater. I'm wearing it here in the size medium. I think it fits perfect. Okay, next up, I have this pull over from A New Day. If you've ever tried, see, I don't even want to say that it's like Lululemon, but this is what I've heard everybody saying. It's comparable to Lululemon. I think I only have one set of Lululemon um, biker shorts and a bra. So I don't know if they have something similar to this because I don't shop there really, but it is very luxe. Like this material, it's like buttery soft. It is the thickness of it is very, very luxe in my opinion. I really love this color as well. It comes in a ton of colors. I got it here in the size small and it runs from extra small. You can get it all the way to 4X, but I really love the way that this feels. It is like so delicious. And then you can pair them with the similar pull on pants, which are these right here. I also got them in the size small. So these are the pull on pants and they are sold separately. These also run from extra small all the way to 4X, but I got them here in the size small. So they're just really a pull on pant. They have them styled sort of like, almost like workwear. Uh, I don't know if I would wear them for workwear. I would be more like casual really. And that's how I kind of style them. So you could definitely put on like some tennis shoes and just pair them with the crew neck and I think you'll be really good, but these feel really nice. They also have the seam that goes down the front of the leg. So it just kind of gives it a little interest to the pants. It also has pockets, which I really appreciate, but just the material is really nice. Usually I don't go for something that is like white like this in the bottoms, but I feel like this material is thick enough where it's not going to be see-through. Next, I have this sweater from Universal Thread. So I really liked this sweater because it kind of plays on that whole like rugby type of style. I don't know if, I don't know how old y'all are, but <laughs> when I was in high school, the early 2000s, uh, they, this was like a really like, um, popular trend. A lot of kids in my school would have like that rugby, like slash polo style shirt. So this is kind of a play on that. And these are actually coming back this season. So you'll see a lot of them. So I have it here in this tan and like taupey 
color. It also comes in gray. I grabbed it here in the size medium. I really liked the way that this fit. It was like not super oversized, but it was just like a nice relaxed fit. And it does have the collar and then the three buttons right here. I paired this one with these black pants that I actually purchased a few weeks ago. I have been on the hunt for some nice like black trousers that are a little bit more like oversized. I have gone to Abercrombie, I've gone to Nordstrom, I've gone to Banana Republic. Like I cannot find some that fit. The closest ones were probably at Abercrombie, but because they are pleated and you know, because I am a mom, like it just like, it just did not look good. So I found these at Target and I absolutely love them. These are from Wild Fable and these trousers I absolutely love because they have that like slouchy relaxed fit. They are pleated in the front, but I don't know if it's just like the material, the way that it's cut, like it's not unflattering if you know what I mean. At first I had styled them with some all black uh, Sambas, but even though it did look good, for some reason like the top already is a little bit more like masculine. And I felt like with the oversized pants and then like with the tennis shoes, it was just like a little bit too masculine for me. While I do like a casual look, I still kind of want to have like little bits of femininity in my outfit. So I just traded it for some ballet flats that I had shared from Walmart. I absolutely love these ballet flats just because they're not super round toe. Um, they're almost like a square round and they just look really nice. So I think it also helps with so much volume down at the bottom whenever you have a smaller uh, shoe that shows a little bit of your foot. So with the Sambas, obviously it's like covers my whole foot and it just kind of looks really bottom heavy. But when you have a smaller shoe that's gonna show a little bit of the top of my foot, it just kind of like breaks it up and just balances it out really nicely. Also, you can never go wrong with a pointed like sling back or a pointed uh, ballet flat. I think those will really look nice with these pants as okay, well. Okay, next I have these jeans from Wild Fable. I have been looking for some leopard pants. Like I just really have not quite like found the right pair. So when I saw these at Wild Fable, I just picked them up and took them home and I was like, we're just gonna get a medium, we'll see if it fits. I will say they run a little bit large. Usually I am a medium, but this was a little bit oversized. It is supposed to have a more relaxed fit, but I feel like a small probably would have been a little bit better for me, especially like around the hip area, which is like shocker, like <laughs> never get anything small at the bottoms. But these definitely, they do run a little large. So I'm gonna exchange these for a small, but I really love the uh, leopard print on these. I paired this one with the uh, creamy pullover that I shared earlier. I really liked the way that that looked. These jeans run from extra, extra small all the way to 4X, but I will recommend that you need to size down one from your usual size. You'll still have that relaxed fit, but it will just fit a little bit better around the hips. Okay, like. next I have this cardigan from Universal Thread. I think this will be a really nice addition for your workwear outfits that you can obviously transition into weekend or like family time, obviously. But I really liked the cable knit detail throughout. And then obviously the stripe. It does have a lot of trends going on. So definitely I would pair this with just like a nice simple pair of jeans. I think it would look really nice. I paired them with my Sofia Vergara jeans. So definitely a great weekend outfit if you are planning to do things with the kids for especially for like Thanksgiving break or winter break. I got it here in the size medium. It goes from extra small all the way to 4X. Also comes in two other colors. There's like a um, burgundy and then there's also a gray. Next I have another piece from Universal Threads quilted jacket. I have it here in the extra large just because this is the only one I could find in store. But when I put it on, I actually really liked how oversized it was. I really love this brown color. Very nice with like these details here on the sleeve. There's also the same detail on the back. It has the snap buttons as well as a zipper for the closure and also i mean like there's like so much that's going on with this jacket there's also these like little pull ties right here that you can pull so i guess whenever it gets like super cold if i could do this there we go so you can pull it and that way it like cinches around your wrist you also have the same ties down here so definitely like keep all that cold wind off of you. Mainly I really liked this color, but whenever I put it on, and especially when I paired it with the creamy pull on pants and the crew neck sweater, I really liked the way that all of that looked. These jackets are really good, especially for like the windier weather. Uh, I know we're gonna start getting cold now, so definitely pairing like a sweater underneath this 
and I think you'll be good. Okay, next I have this cardigan from Universal Thread. This one was so good. I actually, my mother-in-law, she saw me wearing this one and we had to go get her one because she wanted one as well. So it comes in two other colors. There's like a darker gray, there's this taupey color, and then there's also a cream. I got it here in the size medium. It goes from extra small to 2X. Obviously they run a little bit oversized, but I just really loved this material. It's so yummy and like stretchy. And I love a long cardigan, like absolutely. It does have the pockets here in the front as well, but this one is like just something that you can definitely curl up, watch your like Christmas movies in, or you know, if you need to make a run to the store, these are like, it's almost like you're wearing a rope. Like it just fit, feels so good. And it definitely, you can pair it with anything. I just paired it with a white bodysuit, some jeans, and those Converse shoes. And I just really liked how it kind of pulls together the whole outfit, but just a very, very cozy, cardigan. If you're looking for one, this one is definitely it. Next, I have this sweater. How adorable is this sweater with the bows? I actually went in store and they had like this whole like winter display where it had like just the, the mittens, there's hats, there's the sweaters. And so I was looking at the sweaters and I saw this one. I absolutely fell in love with them. It has like a very minimal balloon sleeve but it just feels so good. This one is a size medium. They do run a little bit oversized, but I love the medium on me. They come in a bunch of different like colors. Like if you're looking for like something like brighter, you're gonna find that if you want something a little bit more muted, if you want something that is like definitely Christmassy, there's one that has Apreski. Apreski? Apres? I also got it over here in this one. This is the other print that you can get it in. It has like these red embroidered cherries and I just thought that they were so adorable. Also these on the tag, obviously I already took the tag off, but on the tag they also have like another additional tag in a bow where you can actually make it out to somebody. So this will be a really great holiday gift idea. If you know somebody who's like really into like cozy sweaters, I think that they would really enjoy these. And they already have the tag for you to write their name on it. All you have to do is just put it in a bag and like give it to them. I got these two because they weren't super, super holiday inspired. So it's something that you could definitely wear you know, even after Christmas, you're not gonna feel weird like wearing something that says like Merry Christmas <laughs> on your sweaters. But these two are definitely on the top of the list for my favorite finds. Next, I have these black jeans from Levi's. In case you didn't know, Target has a large selection of Levi's jeans. And so I grabbed these. These are the 724 high rise flare jeans in soft black i think is the color i got them here in the size 29 there is a 32 inch inseam so just depending on how tall you are i am 5 6 and i felt like these went all the way down which was perfect they also have minimal stretch so they're not very rigid so if you're looking for something that's a little bit more comfortable i think you'll really enjoy these jeans i love these just paired with like a nice cozy sweater and like some tennis shoes i think it looks really nice it'll be a great like outfit if you have a sporting event to go to during the fall, or even if you're gonna go watch holiday lights, I think you'll really enjoy these because they're easy to move around in. And like a good pair of black jeans like just never goes out of style. Like I try to kind of mix a little bit of trendy around here with some capsule wardrobe. And I feel like you cannot go wrong with like a simple black pair like this without any like distressing, there's no holes or anything. It's just something that you can either wear casually or dress up if you want to. Okay, next I have these shoes from Universal Thread. Absolutely love these. I've been wanting to get some like ballet flats with like Mary Jane ballet flats, but I just have not found the right pair. So whenever I saw these, I just thought they were like so cute. They're obviously very seasonal with the little Sherpa, but I just think they are adorable. They also come in black. I will say that they run a little large. So I got my regular size 10 but I feel like there's like a lot of room here in the toe box. So I might exchange them for a nine and a half to see how that fits. But I just really liked the way these look. I also ordered another pair that was like a silver sling back with this really pretty bow in the front, something that you could definitely dress up and it's still gonna be comfortable because it's a kitten heel but it's not here yet. I think I might get it tomorrow. So definitely follow me on Instagram and LTK. Again, both of those links are down in the description because I will be obviously, as soon as they come in, like I'm gonna be sharing them there. I will also be styling those shoes because I just think there's so much like styling capabilities. So don't forget to follow me 
Another item I wanted to share was my bag. So I actually purchased this a few weeks ago and it was supposed to be kind of like more of a gym bag, but it is like so convenient that it's become my everyday bag. So like I even have like a key here already um, of all my stuff is in my bag. Uh, but I just absolutely love this bag just because it's so comfortable. Kind of like a little like puffery type of a bag. It has like the top handles right here, but then it also has the straps. These are not detachable by the way, but I guess if you wanted to, you could definitely stick them into the bag and hide them. And then you just have like a tote, you know, so, but I use these because they're just so comfortable. But <laughs> my husband said that I need to wash it because I have been wearing this like for weeks now. Um, but it's just that I absolutely love this purse. So it does come in about four other colors. I think it's like a black, there's a printed one, and I want to say there's a brown. So this is more of the cream colored, but I absolutely love this bag. Another item I wanted to share that could be a really great holiday gift idea is this blanket. Now last week during my Walmart haul, I did share a blanket that was similar. It had like the Sherpa on the inside and it was like this like really nice fleece on the other side. So this one is from Target and I just really loved the houndstooth and it also is like this, what is that taupe, beige, beige houndstooth. Uh, but I really love this one. My Walmart one was a tad bit bigger, but this one is still like, this is really nice. So like my daughter is sleeping with the one from Walmart because she absolutely loves that one. So I was just like, okay, that's yours. Like you can have it. And then this one is in our TV room. And so I like to snuggle up and watch my Dateline. And it's just like, just, Delicious. I absolutely love this one. But again, I just wanted to bring it to your attention because I feel like these are such great gift ideas, especially for coworkers or if you have a friend that's like more of an acquaintance, you don't quite, you know, like you don't feel comfortable getting them clothes or anything like that. I think like a nice blanket, like who doesn't love a nice blanket during the winter? Well, that is the end of my Target haul. I hope you enjoyed this little Target haul. I know I don't do Target as much, but just let me know if it's something that you enjoy or if you want me to go back to doing more Walmart ones. I always love to get feedback from you guys. Nice feedback, okay? Because some people are real bold in the comment section. Anyways, as a reminder, all the items that I shared with you today will be linked down below. And if you're a fashion girly who loves affordable style, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Go ahead and give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed this video. I hope you have a wonderful day and we'll chat soon. Bye.